What's going on YouTube? Casey here with another NBA Live mobile video. As always, this video is presented by the EA Game Changers Network, and you guessed it, we are back, part three. We're doing gameplay with that 88 overall season master, Bill Russell. Let's jump in and take a look at his stats. We just saw Dennis Rodman in the last video, and Dennis Rodman is arguably the greatest rebounder of all time. Um, this is the guy that he's got to go against, pretty much. A lot of people say Wilt, but, you know, Bill Russell was a better rebounder than Will Chamberlain, and that's pretty much seen in the stats. The fact that Russell was 6'10", Wilt was 7'1", and a freak of nature, and, and Bill Russell's rebounding is just absolutely monstrous. Let's see what his stats say. So he's got a 65 speed, which, oof, that's going to hurt. But, you know, we're not going to feel it so much, I don't think. 80 agility is decent. Um, 85 strength is pretty good. 89 vertical, 92 tip in. 87 and 85 offensive and defensive rebounding. That feels low. If I'm not mistaken, that's not higher than Scottie Pippen. Yes, yeah, Scottie Pippen was better at rebounding than Bill Russell, apparently, which is just a complete ridiculous statement. Um, 85 dunk, 87 layup, 85 inside paint shot, scoring with contact. He can't really shoot. He's got a 65 three-point shot, slightly better than Rodman's, but a 78 mid-range, which is slightly worse than Rodman's. 80 on-ball defense. He's got an 82 block, only a 67 steal, 92 offensive and defensive box out, and offensive footwork, 91 offensive post strength and post savvy, 85 post shot, 86 defensive post strength, triple threat, 85 hands in post and defensive post footwork. He's going to be a monster in the post, but EA did him a little dirty here. I, I can't lie, the stats on this card are not as good as Pippen and Rodman, in my opinion. That doesn't necessarily mean anything. It may not translate that way. So let's jump right in. We are going to play Luis. Ooh, quarter four of four. Tied 25 to 25. Let's see how Bill Russell stacks up. Let's see if he can take it home for us. And then we'll go ahead and we will play against Iverson right after. Bill Russell's already in the paint. Let's see what he does here. Oh, he's just going right up with it. Oh, I thought that was going to be a dunk. He just tips it off of the outside of the rim. That's not going to do it. That's not going to help us. That's not a good shot. I was actually hoping that he was going to back down in the post, and then he didn't. Um, Ingram catches me going for... Uh, I mean, I got caught. You know, it wasn't really even a pump fake. I just... I assumed that he was shooting. All right, here's Bill Russell. Let's see what he does. Okay, he's pretty open for that one. He's going to slam that down for sure. There shouldn't be any question with any of these guys going in for big dunks at this point. Um, again, they are by far the top three players in the game. Bill Russell, um, Scottie Pippen, and Dennis Rodman. Okay, Bill's in the post here. He's going to get a little inside paint shot. He's going to make that. It, it counts as a layup, but it wasn't really a layup. Um, I think that he's going to be pretty dominant in the post. Let's see if we can get him the ball back and see what happens here. So Donovan on Wiggins. Can I get the freaking ball back? No, I can't. But let's go. It, either that was a blown dunk or that was a, um, a stop by Bill Russell. And then he goes in for a layup of all things. I thought he was going in for a massive slam and he doesn't. He just lays it up casually. Bill Russell, right? Bill Russell's game was not predicated on flash. He gets a big rebound there. His whole game, he was like kind of like Tim Duncan before there was Tim Duncan, right? There's a big dunk though. Bill Russell played like, you know, Mr. Fundamental. Um, his game was pretty sound wherever he needed it to be. He was just a competitor at the end of the day. That's what he wanted to do. That's what he did. Um, and it's evidenced by... Ooh, there we go. Let's get the block there. Let's get another block there. Come on, Bill. Let's go, Bill. Okay, so the defense is there on Bill Russell. Oh, that's, that's not where I was going with that. Trying to pass it to the guy right next to me. Bill Russell, right next to me. I don't think the game understands what my game is. Um, but yeah, that's, that's what, you know, that happens sometimes. But yeah, Bill Russell, um, he's got, what, 11 championships? That's, you know, that's not a number that you get by accident. Let's see if Bill Russell cuts. Where is he even? Here's Rodman wide open. What the heck? Why was Lillard so far out? Where is Russell? Okay, there he is. Bill, don't go to the three... Okay, fine. You want to take a three-point shot? No, that's Donovan Mitchell. He hits the shot, though. I'll take it. Why not? I thought Bill Russell... Bill Russell was right there. I don't know what happened. Um, let's go, Bill Russell, with the stop. We get a last-second shot with Pippen. That's going to miss for sure. We saw the net switch there for a second, but that missed 100%. Um, but Bill Russell already looking real solid. 
We're going to jump in. Obviously, we win this game, which is always nice to see. We win at 36-29, and we're going to jump in against Iverson right away. We're up by five going into quarter number three, so that's a good sign. We did well against him with Dennis. Let's see what we can do with Bill. We are going to be continuing the same thing. I do definitely want to try a three-point shot with Bill Russell. Let's see what he can do. Theoretically, he should be able to hit it because Dennis Rodman hit two. Dennis Rodman hit a three-point shot in each quarter, and his three-point shot is absolute hot garbage, um, and he still managed to hit that. So let's see what happens. Here we go. We're going to give it over to Bill Russell. Can we get him a, a decently open shot? No, it doesn't look like it. We're going to have to kick out to him, I'm sure. He's going to go for a really difficult shot over here. Is that going to drop? It doesn't. Oh, wow. It did go in. That's crazy. 85 scoring with contact showing up right there. Um, let's see if we can get the ball back right here. It looks like we should be able to, um, but no. This is why I play press box when I play competitively, because that looked like I was right on the money, but uh, Scotty gets a nice rebound. It looked like I was right on the money for that steal. Let's see Bill Russell. Go Bill Russell. Let's go Bill Russell. Come on. There it is. Scotty playing a little point forward, giving a big alley-oop to Big Bill, and we are going to get the two points right there. There's the steal. Let's give this right back to Bill Russell. Here he is. A little spinorama. That's a pretty open three-point shot. He misses it. I think we're going to have to kick out to him, like I was saying. If we really want him to hit something, that's a better shot to kick out there. And that one he hits also might be a point of reference. Maybe the kick out three gives you a little boost in the percentage of shot, uh, of shot make or something like that. We got an easy steal right there. Here comes Bill Russell. We're going right at the defender and just jumping over him. I don't even care. I don't know if that was Kyrie. I don't know who that was, but it didn't matter. Get out of my way. Bill Russell's coming through. Um, the man is a force to be reckoned with. Honestly, he is impactful defensively, and he can do it all offensively too. Let's see if he can hit this like sidestep mid-range. He misses that one. But man, he's going to go for the fadeaway post shot. Not what I was trying for. Let's see this post shot. Oh, that was a perfect timing release. What happened? What is happening? Let me shoot. Defensive trap. While being closely defended, you cannot pump fake your opponent. In these situations, your player will go for a shot. I wasn't trying to pump fake, and it made me screw up my shot. All right, Bill Russell, show him what's good. Show him how we do. We're going to slam that down on everybody because I don't know what the heck that was. But when all else fails, just bring down the heat, you know? Throw down a dunk on everybody like you don't care, like you have bad intentions. We almost get a steal there. We're not going to get it. Close out the quarter with a solid defensive play by Dennis Rodman. And we are going to end it there. We're going to take a nice 12-point lead on the back of Bill Russell, 11-4. He hits the three-pointer. He's got some dunks. He gets a nice alley-oop. Um, I'm going to check Discord. Be right back. My guys in my league are great, man. I can't get shout out to Luis and shout out to Iverson. I just happened to see them online while I was online and they were like, are you playing me? Are you playing me? I want to play you back. Let me help you get gameplay footage. So shout out to them so I didn't have to go into seasons. We really just got, okay, I'm going to go play events. Tell me when to play you, Casey. Like, these guys are great, man. And he's going back and checking the league chat. I guarantee it. And like league chat, I don't even like league chat. I don't go to league chat, so... For him to go through and check that, that's pretty cool. Let's open up a few of these packs, just because why not? Always nice to open up some all-NBA packs. See if we can pull a lead. I've opened some packs today. The chance should be fairly good that I'm getting an elite at some point here soon. We get Pokusevsky, no elite there. We're going to open up, what, let's, let's just, let's burn through like 10 packs real quick. So that was pack number one. See if we can pull in a lead here. We get Dorian Finney-Smith and Buddy Heald in pack number two. There's a... I don't remember what it is offhand. It's not high, the chance. We get... Uh, I don't even know what his name is. Josh Green. Um, there, there's a low chance of pulling, I think, a 79 or better. Maybe it's a 78 or better. I don't even remember. Uh, pack number four, we get Dennis Schroeder. Um, maybe it's a 77 or better. There's like a 2.5% chance, something like that. Uh, maybe a 3% chance, maybe a 7% chance. I really don't remember what the number is. Buddy healed right over there. But basically, the chance of pulling an elite is low. Um, we get Andrew Wiggins, a base Andrew Wiggins. I haven't seen that card before. Our fifth pack, we're halfway through. Let's open up five more over here. 
Cross our fingers for an elite. And we get Ivica Zubak and Buddy Heald again in pack number six. Moving on to pack number seven. And we're going to open up an 85 overall trade set too. Because why not? We get Cole Anthony and we get Bay. I don't know his first name. That's pack number seven, I think. I really got to study those rookies because I don't know their names. Um, we get Reggie Jackson and Devontae Graham in pack number eight. Pack number nine. Let's see what we get here. Can we pull an elite? That would be so far. We got Kyle Kuzma and pack number 10. Anything coming out of this one right here. Let's see real quick. Boom, we get Obi Toppin. Okay, so no elites out of there. Let's jump in and get ourselves a guaranteed elite with a trade upset. You already know I've been pulling for that James Harden. Let's do that over here. I'm just going to spend the 23 and a half cash. Um, I think, how far am I from getting a 70? Yeah, I don't have enough resources to get three uh, to get even 178 79 i don't think um so let's go back over here and let's just open this let's spend the cash you guys know i'm gonna get it back anyway 85 overall trade up player you already know we want to see that james harden i will take steph curry but i want to see james harden who are we gonna get three two one boom we get jason tatum i pulled jason tatum in the first video which remember for to me is still today um, even though they're going to release in subsequent days. Jason Tatum, welcome to the team again. Um, but that basically means that on my stream, which is probably going to be Saturday night, you can look out for a Jason Tatum quick sell. 85 overall Jason Tatum. We're going to trigger Goat by selling his favorite player, I think. Um, so that'll be fun. 5,000 coins for Jason Tatum. We're going to do that on Saturday night most likely, but I will keep you guys posted anyway. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Smash that like button, hit subscribe, turn on notifications, follow me on Twitch, come join my Discord server, join EA's Discord server. Everything is down in the description below. It's all popping off and we are going to have a really good time with it. So I will see you at the next one. Peace.